Good morning, Internet. Back again with another Bomberman tutorial. No, this is not a tutorial. Good morning, Internet. Back at it again with a Bomberman episode, part, piece, whatever this is. Let's clone Bomberman. Yeah. So I didn't get that much done with Bomberman yet, but I did want to make this video because I want to add in a slight tutorial how-to section on how to actually upload your games to a browser or to at least get them playable in a browser. Now, to do this through GameMaker, you are going to need to purchase the HTML5 export. I don't quite know how much it is. I found it on Humble Bumble for, like, stupid cheap, so keep your eyes out for there. If you have it already and you don't know how to use it, then this is going to help you out. But let's first look at Bomberman, see what I've got done so far, and just go from there. If somehow you don't know where the HTML, H, HTML5 export is or how to run it there, you just go up to Target, come on down to HTML5, and that's pretty much where you can pick on any exports that you have for your Game Maker program. So if we hit play, it's going to pop this up in a browser and just play it blank in the window. Like. Oh, and it popped up on the wrong screen. Here we go. So we have our man plays in a browser. As you can see, got a little, little doohickey. And oh, let me click in here first. And the game works. The only thing that I've added so far is, as you can see, there are enemies, there are bombs. He's all freaking out. You kill the bombs, you get the points, the enemy counter counts down. Uh, if you die, or if you're under them, game resets. You blow up yourself. Blow up yourself. Game resets. You can't right, quite see it. Some of the timing is a bit off. Some of the enemy walking around, I've got to change a bit of that, make it run a little more smoothly, a little more smoothly and run a little more like Bomberman does. But it does work. It is playable. I haven't done anything with God damn it. I haven't done anything with adding any of the perks or the bonuses or any of that. Haven't had a lot of time to. But the enemies are working. The explosions work. Some better animation is needed. But to get into HTML5, let's close this. First, you're going to want to go up to File. If I can click File, Create Application, and you're making the well, it kind of creates a few files. Basically, just go to wherever you want to put this. I just put this in a folder of Bomberman. As you can see, I've already saved it here. So if we look at that folder, all we have is the window way too big. Yeah. All we have is an HTML5, uh, HTML5 game that's going to have a lot of your assets, all that jazz, some icons, some index, and some stuff that actually doesn't really matter. So I like to use Google Drive to kind of host the, uh, the game because it's pretty simple and it's free and both of those are things that I enjoy. So you're going to go over to your Google Drive account. As you, well, as you will see, I've already set this folder up. And basically just make a folder. I call the Bomberman and drag those files right into here. That's all you need to do on this end. The next steps are uh, not confusing, but a little bit annoying at times. So now that you're in your Google Drive, you can open up a new tab and add this URL. Just copy it from the, the video description and put it there or just type it out googledrive.com forward slash host forward slash. From here you're going to want to go into right click on a whatever your file is, whatever you called it, and grab a shareable link. Now if you come here through shareable link you can just highlight everything after the equal sign or if you come through share and you see a link here you'll actually notice that it has a little more to it. It has an ampersand USP equals sharing and all this other stuff. What you want is everything from the after the equal sign before the ampersand. The other link doesn't have the ampersand, so I already grabbed that. Then come back up to this link and add that little bit. So as you saw, there was an equal sign there, ampersand over here. Add that together, and that is your working link for your game. I'm going to copy that paste. Copy that paste. I'm going to copy that quick before I hit enter. And we're good. We're in the game and it's playing just like it was when I launched it from Game Maker. And that's really all that there is to it. It's really easy to do and just thought it'd be simple enough to put that in this video since I don't have that much of the game updated yet. From there, if you want a cleaner URL, you don't have to type in all that. You can go to tinyurl or any of the other hyperlink-esque websites and make a custom URL for that. That's also free, easy to do. The uh, link in the description should be Bomberman Part 2 or something like that, and that will link to what I have right now. From now on, every time I put up a video, there will be a link to the progress that I made so far, and I would really appreciate it if you guys would play those. Uh, give it a try, play it around. If you find any bugs or any issues, just 
post them in the comments. It helps me out a lot as well as, well, as far as that's some debugging that I might not have time to get to. So thank you guys so much for following along. I hope this has helped at least somewhat. Hopefully somebody's looking for how to export HTML5. And yeah, I will see you guys again. That's it. Peace.